Hey everyone, welcome back to the confused and they then to some more of the Shadow to Tomb Raider, the Forge. Uh, I'm not sure whether the Forge is the part of the game's name or is it something else? Because when I downloaded the game, it's only the Shadow to Tomb Raider, not the Forge. Okay, so let's see what's up ahead consumable caves. I think the loading screen it's not gonna change anyway but before proceeding guys don't forget to subscribe my channel and do let me know about it that what more games you want to see on this channel and also about this game it's been like the game is three years old by the way but the graphics in this game they are next level So our next storm that's gonna be Amazon River Paro. I think that's in Brazil. Uh, I'm not sure. Well, we'll see. So up till now we were playing the game of two days ago, and now we are going to see the same scene which we saw at the start of the game. Uh, they're gonna be in some sort of storm, and they're playing. I think that's going to crash anyway. For a volcanic mountain. The crown of silver is probably a band of clouds. I just can't get those people back there out of my head. They lost everything. The riddle says, chase the heart of the serpent to the silver crown mountain where the twins confer. I wonder what the twins are. The storm looks like bad news. It's just a little rain. We'll concentrate on the cloudy mountain. Cloudy mountain. If we find it, how do we know we have the right one? Gut feeling? It's our only clue. The mural says there'll be more disasters. The best way we can help them is to put a stop to it and Trinity. Okay. But how do we really know? Jonah, what I felt when I took the dagger. You mean the tremors or the tsunami? More than that. It felt like I woke something up. I know that it's not practical. I know that it's hard to believe, but you need to trust me. We have to trust each other. Hey, I might have something over here. Really? <gasps> That's it! I don't like this storm. Should we come back in the morning? We're so close. I guess a little turbulence wouldn't stop Trinity either. Miguel, is there anywhere to land? Yeah, I can put you down near Kuak Jaku. Let's go. This uh, that scene, I think uh, we we might have already crashed somewhere, and we are going. Yep, there you go. We are going to make some sort of jungle. Sort of, but it's actually a jungle. And we are going to. 
fight with the tiger because we have seen the tiger in the dog of the game. We can listen to the all sort of sounds that could exist in jungle I mean, from the animals to the river to the sound a hissing sound of wind. Moreover, we don't have any kind of weapons with us. So not not even the bow and arrow. I think they that that was in the plane and we might have to find them. Find all the weapons. Up, up till then we we are on our own and we cannot find anyone else either but we can hear different sounds some monkeys some um, I'm not sure the birds I'll keep this for later the compass I mean that something Lara always Silver have with her in I'm all of the movies and I think in the previous games too someone's over there I have to get to them that's another adventurous walk uh, I know it's just a walk. I think I have to jump several times. Can you do that? I'll be taking something from a pigeon's nest. It's bad. But I think that that's what survivor needs in the jungle. To get what he can and then use that for his safety maybe. For the... I don't know. For the benefit. <coughs> is is that a camp? Someone must be around. Can't you like, Hello? Uh, Jonah. Take a rest. Is it some sort of safe Where house in our whole journey? Because uh, we are gonna be in jungle for the whole game, I think. Uh, I'm not sure, but we will see. But the story, how it is going, and the loading screen, moreover, uh, the starting mechanism, they will show that the whole game that's gonna be in jungle. I didn't know the storm would hit so hard. This is all my fault. I should have listened to Jonah, thought it through. I never should have taken that dagger. I hope no one else was hurt. No other village destroyed. I need to stop these cataclysms before it's too late. So this camp, it's sort of a shop too, because we can like get new skills from the camp and I think we can get the new weapons from the camp too or what there there were three things we will see uh, well what are the new skills we have I think the black ones they are like locked So, so you cannot simply go ahead and 
get any skill you have to purchase adjacent skill I think I mean for leading up to the skill number eight you have to gain all the seven skills and I think when we gain all of the skills the bigger one the blue the big blue big red and big green they're gonna be unlocked So there are three things we can do from the camp but two of them are unavailable and one the skills they are available. I think you have to reach up to a certain XP level to get both of them unlocked and then use them. Uh, for now, to the plane now landed think, here. Yep, my gear is in the cargo. I'll need to cut it down. Search for my weapons. Yeah. I need something to cut that down. Might be a sharp piece of scrap in that section of the rack. I think we're going to make some sort of weapon from the wreckage. Uh, she mentioned that. Uh, we will see. Can we go? No, we cannot go up from this point. We have to reach that blue spot. And it's right there. But. I don't think so we can simply jump from that point because it's a Tomb Raider and you cannot get anything that easily. You have to like solve some sort of riddle or do something. I mean we cannot go there without without doing anything without solving anything. Did you notice that when we get out of the water, she what she does to her hair? That's incredible. Uh, I'm also thinking that we might get to that point using uh, those trees, but I'm unable to climb them. So there is there is something else I need to do. Uh, we cannot cut this up. I mean, we need to cut this, but we don't have anything, and that's a we are. We, we have to find something and that's over there on the blue wreckage uh, can we climb this maybe a piece there? of scrap from the wreck uh, I think we can climb that from that white mark <coughs> go, yep, yep we are on the right path I'll uh, need a tool that? to open that the tool? okay so we don't have even a knife but we need to go that point. Uh, okay. Can you can jump there? Can you like use this tree? Well, it's still a confusion. I just thought that we might have to grab that drop and then slide ourselves to the plane wreckage. I think we are going to use the wing from the plane wreckage. Uh, that's my. Uh, I mean, that's what I'm thinking. Won't be able to open that Not without sure. a tool. Well, uh, that's funny. I mean, I was trying to get that point using other techniques, but we can simply fuck to that. I mean, ah, uh, okay. Now, what we have to do? We might have to jump into the water and then get that wing, the sharp one. Hey, something's gonna happen, and we 
don't have any knife with us too. So how we are supposed to? Okay. So that's our chance. Save it up. Hey you. So we have first to sell a knife and we get closer now. We need to find something to, to sharpen find it. Something. Okay, so but we still have to sharpen it. I think we can like use those boxes which we were unable to open and then sharpen the knife. Let's uh, let's see. I think there uh, there was a box on the top of that. Okay, we went exactly one what there. I was looking for. Just okay, need a bit so more. We have collected two, and and another box was up there. <laughs> there we go. Now we get it. Got everything I need. Should head back to camp. I don't know why does she mention that we have to head back to the camp. Needs to be sharper. Maybe. If we can sharpen this knife over the camp, I mean we have enough weapons, we have enough abilities, but we have to be here. Okay, yep, there we go. And it's inventory, and we have knives. Uh, make shift. Yep, there we go. So basically, we j we have we had collected the parts for making the knife and sharpen it, and now we actually have created that knife. And we have sharpened that. That too. should be sharp enough. So now we have a proper knife, and we can use this knife to get our more weapons. Something still holding the supplies up. I think I know what to do. There was another rope hanging at that point. We have to cut that. Too. So let's see whether I'm right or not. We have to do it. There we go. Hey. Uh, okay. Yes. Yep. Now I can get my gear back. Now let's see what gear I have. Maybe we don't have all of the weapons. Like we have a um, rifle, I think. A pistol. Um, a shotgun. <sighs> and bow. Okay, so right now we only have bow. Why didn't have I pack other all my weapons, equipment together? Yep. Okay, she also says that. So we only have this weapon, and yeah, I'll look at her. Miss Croft, anyone? Come in. Miguel, where are you? Damn. I don't think so. We can interact with those yellow crates. Yep, we cannot. Uh, so whenever you turn on the survival instincts, they does show you the objects with which you can actually interact with and okay i think um, we are going to create a line from this point to that point and then move with the uh let's go closer to this point yep so now we have to do like do this yep Let's get our arrow back. Uh, okay, okay. So, how do we know that we are going to the right path? Again, I they might have like shown this. some sort of compass. Miguel, where are you? Or is oh is no. the same point? <sighs> is this a point where we see the flare? Miguel? Miguel! And this is the blood, I think. Miguel's dead. And we're going to find his dead body anyway. Even if we don't want to, I think the game, how it is going, they will show. Uh, what's that? That's not Miguel's dead body. But I think they're gonna show the dead body of Miguel. We will see.
I don't think that we have to jump from that point. We have to figure out. Yep, here we go. Uh, and that that was unexpected too, because we might have to take the other way to this point, but. I'm not sure whether it's a glitch in game or what or is it designed in this way we have to go down it's I think it's sort of fresh blood that's why flies are over there and we might be closer to the Miguel's dead body. Yep, that's me. Oh shit, man. And I think some tigers. Not the one. The ones here. Wow. Look at the focus on its eyes. And all of them are kind of gathering up to see how the fight goes between this creature and hers so I was thinking right that there are more than one So they are not gonna fight us here. Uh, to be I think here. they are like guiding us to somewhere where they have more power over me. Uh, and I think that's the nature of tigers. Maybe that's how they show that in every movie. Uh, well, we will know. However, they are continuously showing that uh, they are following us and we have to be aware. Uh, yep, here he comes of one. Can they like... Cannot evade him? No, we can tap C to evade incoming attacks. There's only one. It's working. And I'm not sure whether we have enough arrows to do this. But we have to make more of them, I think. I think there is only one now. Uh, I'm not sure where's the second one. He's almost dead. Yep, he's almost dead. Uh, it might take maybe one or more arrows. It's coming. How many arrows will it take? There we go, I think it's last of it. No, yep. Uh, we go. So we attack into his ear.
I was thinking about this second one. But is is it gonna die cause No? What's happening? Where does he hit reckon? It might have another story in the past and we might know in the future what's happening. What's with this second tiger? Okay, so it took its brother. Now we will see what do we have to do now. But that's strange. And there must be a story behind it. With this guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel and do let me know about this game and what more games you want to see on my channel.